Hi, my name is Malia with Urgent Care 24-7. Today we're going to be discussing pulse oximetry. This is something you can do simple at home that's very effective in telling you how your health is and if you may need to go to the doctor or to the emergency room, especially with COVID going on. You can buy a pulse oximeter at a grocery store, a drug store, or Amazon very easily. It's a small device that looks like this and is very, very simple to use. All you do is you open it up, put your finger inside, lay your hand flat and still, and turn on the probe. This is going to tell you your SpO2 and your heart rate. Your SpO2 is the amount of oxygen that's in your blood. Your heart rate is how many times your heart is beating per minute. Your oxygen level, or SpO2, should be between 90 and 100. If your oxygen is below 90, you may want to call your doctor or go to the emergency room. If it's anything below 90, I would personally recommend going to the emergency room or calling your doctor immediately and letting them know what is going on. If you do have any nail polish colors that are a darker color, as in black or red or even a dark purple, you may not be having an accurate measurement. If your hands are very cold or you feel like you're not getting all that blood flow to your hands as your hands have been held up or it is cold outside or in your room, you may still not be having an accurate measurement. There can also be other indications that you may not be receiving an accurate measurement and this should be discussed with your doctor. If you are a normal patient, then measuring your oxygen at home can be a great way to determine your health and whether you may need to contact your doctor. Especially in the times of COVID, if you do have COVID currently, this is a great way to analyze whether you may need to go to the emergency room or not. If you're a healthy patient and you're breathing okay, you're not having any shortness of breath, and you're analyzing your oxygen and it's above 90, then you should be okay without going to the emergency room. If your oxygen is below 90 and you are suffering from some shortness of breath, it may be a good idea to go to the doctor or go to, or go to the emergency room and get checked out. A normal SpO2 or oxygen level for your blood is 90 to 100. A normal heart rate for yourself is between 60 to 100 beats per minute. If it's a little bit below for your heart rate or a little bit above, that's totally normal. If you have been walking around or exercising and these numbers vary, that is also normal. Thank you so much for discussing pulse oximetry with me today. I'm Malia from Urgent Care 24-7. Life is 24-7 and so are we.